with a review for you guys. Um, so I'm going to be reviewing the BH Cosmetics Wild and Alluring palette. Uh, I have the video of me swatching and unboxing this, so I'll probably do a couple swatches, not like, but not anything like. Probably do the whole thing, but anyways, <laughs> uh, if you hear anything in the background, it's my family. Uh, so yeah. Uh, my husband's playing video games, so you'll most likely hear that. So, uh, let's get right into this. So the BH Cosmetics Wild and Learning Palette looks like this, and it opens up. It has a mirror, and then it has nine baked eyeshadows, a blush, and a highlighter. And um, I don't really use this one. I use the uh, Galaxy Chic one more than I use this one, but um, it's not really because... It's honestly not for preference or anything. I think it's mostly just because the uh, Galaxy Chic one has more eyeshadows, so I think I just kind of go to that one. But I definitely am going to start trying this one even more. Um, I think, honestly, the only thing I have a problem with this is the same thing that I have uh, for the Galaxy Chic palette is that they're not matte, they're not matte shades. They're, um, they're shimmery, so it's kind of hard to like put it in your crease and, and blend it out because when you take a picture of it or anything like that, it's very shimmery. So I think um, if they had more matte shades, they do have matte shade like matte eyeshadows on their website i will leave that down below in the description as well as a link to this palette but i've been like really sick these last couple of days so i really apologize but uh they do have palettes that are that have matte and shimmer they do have just shimmer palettes just matte palettes so um i think i'll definitely have to look into those to see how the matte shades kind of i have to get a palette from that from them so that I can uh, kind of just you know balance out the matte and the shimmeries that I have so uh, these unlike the galaxy chic palette don't have names so but these this is what it looks like I'm going to swatch this one right here right now so let's swatch this one look at how gorgeous they're very pigmented and they're so nice. Now I'm gonna swatch uh, this one right here. They're so nice and creamy. They blend beautifully. I mean, I can't really. I don't really have have a lot of like complaints. They just honestly, maybe it's just this is just preference. I'm guessing. I'm gonna swatch the highlighter now. Um, this is just preference, like the whole shimmery matte there's the highlighter on top the whole shimmery matte is literally just preference i mean if you like shimmery shades all over the lid then i think um this palette and the galaxy chic one is definitely your kind of thing um i do put them to good use so i don't want to be ungrateful and be like oh i just don't like i have it and i don't even use it no it's not the case i do use them um i just wish they had more matte shades now that could be my fault because i could have picked you know i could have gotten in the matte shades instead of getting fake eyeshadows so but they do have the uh option in their website they do have matte shades and they do have shimmery shades they do have matte palettes and shimmery palettes so uh i guess i just picked i thought they were gonna be kind of with a variety and that wasn't the case but uh i definitely love it um the shades are beautiful they the highlighter blows me away all the time um it's so pigmented and they're so creamy and they're so easy they grab onto the eyelid so easily and the colors are gorgeous so i honestly don't really think i'm gonna have a problem with it but i mean like i said the only thing is how shimmery like literally the whole palette just shimmer so it's kind of hard for me to kind of contrast it but if you have like another like if you have a regular matte palette or it's like from Morphe or Makeup Geek or something, then you can definitely use the matte shades and then just switch over to the BH Cosmetics and grab a shimmer shade for your lid or whatever it is that you may be doing. So, uh, yeah, so that is my review on the BH Cosmetics Wild and Alluring palette. 
Uh, I'll definitely leave the link to this and BH Cosmetics down below. I'll leave any way you can contact me down below. And yeah, so don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, if you're new, I'm Sylvia. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.